everyone and welcome back to Suzy Q headquarters with me Suzy Q and today I'm going to carry on a little bit with my Mark Boland vlog and I'm actually going to add a song to my JLS playlist from Mark Boland and T-Rex so if you don't want to listen to the song just fast forward to the end to the vlog because I'm doing it all back to front today so I'm going to try and cut to the chase a little bit and also I'm wearing a Mark Boland t-shirt today and not a remote shirt for a change you can see there's his face and uh, yeah so anyways I've had this probably 25 getting on 30 years and I got it when I was a punk rocker and I lived in Birmingham at the time and I used to go around all the record shops just to look at all the Mark Boland records and I've still actually got a few records especially Mark Boland and this song I'm going to sing is from an album actually called Electric Warrior from 1971 and it's the flip side of Jeepster and one of the reasons I actually love this song is the video and I know there's loads of Mark Bond videos on YouTube but this song in particular, he sings a duet with another big star actually of the 70s and her name is Scylla Black and today I'm going to be Scylla Black can't tell the difference can you? <laughs> so yeah I hope you're going to join me with the little sing along but if not, as I said just fast forward to the end <laughs> okay well I'll be updating my information on the Mark Boland meet up <laughs> okay then so let's just as i says let's get on with it so i don't want to ramble on again and again <laughs> you know so um yeah this is the song <laughs> and it's only on the laptop oh, it's our silla with mark Bowler. could have loved you girl like a planet i could have changed your heart to a star but it really doesn't matter at all No, it really doesn't matter at all Love's a guess I could have built a house on the ocean I could have placed our love in the sky But it really doesn't matter at all No, it really doesn't matter at all Love's a guess I could have turned you into a princess in the sand but it really doesn't matter at all no it really doesn't matter at all love's a guess no it really doesn't matter at all no it really doesn't matter at all love's a guess I hope it's gonna last. Oh, thank you so much. I didn't want a standing ovation. But yeah, that was life's a gas. And I do sometimes think life's a gas sometimes. So um, yeah, that was the song. So now I can get on with the Mark Boland vlog. And um, I'm going to refer to my notes so I give you the right information. Okay then. And today I did have an email actually from somebody and I hope I get your name right because <laughs> my pronunciations aren't that great um, yes his name is John Wass and he's part of the official Mark Boland flan, flan? <laughs> sorry about that he's a part of the Mark Boland official fan club I don't think Mark Boland's got a flan club <laughs> well he might have he might like flans I don't know okay then so it's the OMBFC which stands for the official Mark Boland fan club. Okay, and he is a massive Mark Boland fan. So it's really nice to meet another massive Mark Boland fan. Okay then, so he's telling me all about the annual London Bop. And it's where all the fans from all over the world get together to celebrate Mark's life and all the music, obviously. And there's lots of live tribute bands. <laughs> and on the Tavern Pub in Cricklewood on the 16th, 
that's when all the tribute bands get together and obviously there's a converge to Golders Green Crematorium and very quickly I must mention about the tree because apparently this is the deal getting to the tree is very difficult you know going by plane train automobile you know it's not that really apparently easy to get to and you know as I'm going to be traveling by walking you know it's not going to be that easy for me to get to that place so I will probably just go to the gold as green creme so you know that's what everyone else does apparently you know people do go to the tree you know and um, if I could access it I would but I don't think it's going to be that possible <laughs> okay so I just thought I'd let you know that little bit you know if you're thinking of going so okay then so and also they have a short remembrance short silence to the site of remembrance which is all very informal and before that however on the 14th there is an annual anniversary gigs by two of the biggest t-rex bands around they're called t-rex and t-rex to see and the T-Rex C is at the O2 in Islington with special guest star and other Mark. Wait for this, Mark Almond. So that's got to be worth checking out. Okay then. So that I actually looked into that and in the um, I'm online, and the gig price tickets are fifteen pounds. But obviously, you've got to add the booking fee on, which is altogether seventeen pound twenty-five. Okay, so I just thought I'd let you know all that. Um, I think that's about it and if I've missed anything else I will add it on to an updated video so you know I'm just letting you know because you know there's probably other people like me who want to go to the Mark Boland annual get together to celebrate Mark Boland's life and music you know <laughs> and it does sound a bit bizarre for me to say you know it is a little bit scary you know let's face it going to London on your own you know, I'm a bit like Dick Whittington <laughs> with his bag on every shoulder, <laughs> off to London I go, <laughs> you know, it sounds a bit strange, I've been halfway across America and to New York on my own, and the thought of going to New York, New York, London even, is, you know, a little bit scary, but I'm sure I'll get to meet all the Mark Boland fans, and I'm going to document it, even document it all on video, so I can say, yes, I took the bull by the horns, and I went to the Mark Boland anniversary, <laughs> okay then, so thanks for watching me, Susie Q, and remember to stay tuned for more. <laughs> so thanks for watching. <laughs> See you later.